Prince Harry snubs Queen's birthday as he quickly returns home to Meghan Markle. Prince Harry is understood to have already touched base in Los Angeles, meaning he will not be there to support the Queen for her first birthday since losing her husband Prince Philip. Prince Harry is believed to have flown into Los Angeles on an American Airlines flight from London Heathrow shortly after 1.30 p.m. local time, 8.30 p.m. GMT. Yesterday, his chauffeur-driven car was spotted leaving the private terminal just minutes after the plane was landed. The vehicle was also seen arriving in Montecito, where Harry now lives with Meghan Markle and son Archie, at around 4 p.m. Harry's return to the U.S. will undoubtedly raise a few eyebrows, as it means he will miss the Queen's 95th birthday today. The day is likely to be tough for the monarch, who is still in mourning following the death of Prince Philip as it is her first birthday without her husband by her side. She will spend the day at Windsor Castle, where she has spent the majority of the pandemic. Senior royals, including Princess Anne and Sophie Wessex, will visit the Queen via Rota system to ensure Her Majesty is not alone. Her eldest son Prince Charles is not due to visit the Queen, as he is currently staying at his home in Wales. Prince William is also not expected to see his grandmother face to face. Prince Harry returned to the UK for just a fleeting visit, having made the trip back to attend the Duke of Edinburgh's funeral. He is understood to have received a frosty reception from other royals, due to the fallout from his tell-all interview with Oprah Winfrey. The funeral marked the first time Harry had been reunited with the royal family face-to-face -face since March 2020. After the ceremony concluded, the Duke was seen chatting to older brother William as they walked to Windsor Castle. Harry's decision to return home to Meghan did not come easily, as sources told the Mail he was conflicted about whether to stay for the Queen's birthday. Last week it was reported the Duke was missing his wife and son dearly, having not been separated from each other for over a year. A source told US Weekly, a celebrity magazine, Harry is staying in regular contact with Meghan and their son, Archie. The insider also revealed the royal is worrying about his wife who is currently pregnant with their second child. The source said, he's already really missing Meghan and Archie and has been FaceTiming them every day to check in. He actually speaks to Meghan a few times a day because he worries about leaving her when she's so far along in her pregnancy. Having arrived back in the U.S., Harry will now have to quarantine for 10 days. This is due to the mandatory requirement for international travelers journeying to the U.S. But unlike in the U.K., the quarantine measure is not mandatory.